The two-day event comes at a time of declining gold production, with government focusing its efforts on reversing the trend. Burkina Faso's mining sector is one of the most dynamic in the sub-region. Despite the current national situation, the sector has shown resilience. The opportunities are huge and the sector is open to all interested parties. It is true that the sector faces many challenges, but there is still a glimmer of hope because we see the efforts being made to make things safer on the ground. Authorities hope to give more visibility to the local mining sector and particularly attract new investors. This is a mid-declining production as a result of the security situation in the region. The government, the government is taking steps to ensure that mining can continue in the best possible conditions. For mining companies in areas where there is a risk of terrorist attacks, the government is ensuring the safe transport of their supplies so that they can continue to operate. Gold production is a key driver of the Bukinabe economy. The commodity is one of the country's main export products and accounted for 16% of GDP in 2020. During the mining week, investors pledged to support the country in developing its mining sector. The security situation in the country has had a severe impact on almost all of our activities in the country. But we hope that with the support of the government, everything will be fine. We are trying to adapt to the situation and develop our activities as much as possible. The West African region has significant mining potential that remains underexploited. However, in some high-producing countries such as Mali and Burkina Faso, repeated coups have led to a decline in production. Yankinyo, CGTN.